Hey, what's up guys, I'm Nizio Cole, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about some very, very, very interesting news regarding Fortnite. This is everything 8.50, but before we start, make sure to drop a like down below, hit that notification bell, and comment down below what you're most excited for in this update. Remember, if you use our code Nizio underscore team in the item shop, and tweet at me at Nizio Cole on Twitter, a picture of you buying something with the code, I will feature you in my video. And yeah, let's get started. Now, some really, really big news just came out about a really big event, but I'm gonna save the best for last. So the first thing I'm gonna be talking about is that the reboot fan is now disabled and competitive, so Arena, I don't even think World Cup is supposed to have reboot fan in the first place, but if it does, it is disabled, uh, so yeah. No more rebooting your teammate for a while. There have been some issues uh, I know that Epic was talking about. Not that big of a deal, but just something just to think about. Next thing we're going to be talking about is that the rune, you know, I mean, I'm pretty sure everyone is aware of the rune. It started at Lucky, it went to Shifty, and then Greasy, and then it went over to Loot, and that's where it is now. It's honestly, this is one of the cooler things that they've done. So basically, it's like a community action. So however much damage the community does, so everyone around the world shooting this rune, right? However much damage it accumulates, that's how it moves. And I think that's honestly pretty cool. It moves in game. It's actually pretty scary. Uh, if you get on top of it, it knocks you off. You take fall damage or most likely die, considering how high up it is at this point. But it's at loot now, and we're just going to have to wait and see what's going on with this event. At the time of recording, it probably the event's probably already happened by the time this video is up. But yeah, that's everything we know from now. And yeah, I kind of just breezed through those first two topics because I really, 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 really wanted to get to this topic. And that is the Avengers in-game event is confirmed by the Fortnite Twitter and Instagram account. About half an hour ago, they tweeted out whatever it takes. 4 19 so April 25th, that is in three days. And it is a picture of a bright bomber holding the Captain America shield with an Avengers logo in the background and in the bottom left corner, Fortnite with Avengers. And now we know that it is confirmed that there is an in-game event. I actually talked about this in I believe my 8.21 video. But yeah, this is definitely interesting. I really hope it's a lot better than the Infinity Gauntlet. I hope it has more details, more uh, characters you can play as, and hey, maybe they might release a Marvel themed skin, or, or a few skins. Honestly, Iron Man, Captain America, Thor, Captain Marvel most likely because that's a pretty new movie. I'm just sticking to Iron Man, Cap Thor, and Captain Marvel because those are pretty much the, the standard. Like you would want these as skins and you know as soon as they release these skins, Epic and Marvel are going to make so much money. It's ridiculous because everyone who doesn't want an Iron Man skin. I mean, that's crazy. That's what we... I, I can speak for the entire Fortnite community when we say that's what we wanted in Season 4. We wanted a whole bunch of superhero, off-brand superhero type skins, but we got we got Omega, which was alright. It wasn't the best, and it didn't really feel like a superheroes themed season. I feel like they could have done better with the Infinity Gauntlet LTM last year too, but you know, hey, we can learn from our mistakes, and I'm really excited for these skins. So yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about. I will make sure... Trust me, guys. I will make sure to update you guys on this LTM. I'm super excited. I'm super excited for Endgame, which is out the 26th. I'm super excited for this event, which is out the day before, the 25th. And yeah, that's pretty much all I had to talk about. I'll see you guys later. Peace.